Hello everybody, welcome back to Pink Crafty World. And today I'm gonna have a project and I'm gonna try to do a tutorial on this um, cute um, bracelet uh, that I'm gonna, in, you know, try to create uh, with you guys using these lace trims. Um, I've been noticing that these type of, you know, for summer now, uh, everybody is using cute bracelets. We see the trending of uh, different beads and hishi beads and different trims. And I decide why not use lace trims and make a bracelet, make a cute bracelet for summer uh, that you can make in different colors and embellish and, you know, uh, you know, use it uh, to match uh, your sandals or your clothing and look cute for the summer. So I come up with this here and I hope the camera do um, some justice to this. And uh, look how pretty it is. Um, these products are from BB Craft and um, I shared with you guys about two weeks ago, this unboxing. Um, where they send me uh, these lace uh, trims in different colors. And I just come up with this. Um, these pieces here, the, the jewelry findings, those are from uh, packages that I received from BB Craft um, previously. And also the heart in the middle, the charm are from previously um previous um unboxings that i did uh, but i still have them in hand and i you know like to incorporate them with my new packagings and my new unboxings and i decide to come up with these and look how cute guys and when you put them on um i don't know because you know i'm against the camera but you know if you put them on in your hand they're gonna be looking cute like that. See? And you will wear them like that. And you will tie them here. They were, they are supposed to look, you know, be tied in your hand, not too loose. Not too tight, of course, but not too loose. And I think it looks very pretty, very girly. And yeah, why not, right? So let's make one of these and we are going to make a different color now so um why not to make a purple one so let me grab this um purple for my purple friends here um and we just gonna cut about five inches and a half of this um trim so one, two, three, four, five and a half. So I will go there. You know, I go, go five inches and a half um, measuring my wrist. Uh, you have to measure yours and see, you know, how big you want it. And we're just going to cut a tiny piece, you guys see. And always make sure that you know, you know, what is the front and back of your ribbon in this case um for me this is the front piece so i'm gonna leave it like that and um oops also bb craft sent me this previously so i'm gonna grab from this box i'm gonna grab two of these which i have them here and these measure about three fourths of an inch and I'm gonna grab a piece of ch a chain from this kit. And this chain, it's about, um, about one and three fourths of an inch long. I want to grab a laster clasp for the closure. Um, I want to grab some jump rings and we're going to need one, two, three, four, about five jump rings. Let's 
so let me see I have to open these here um, okay I think that be okay for now whoops I think I get more out than what I need but let me put them back because I don't want you know them to get waste and also I have these here they also came in the I don't know the the name exact name of this piece here but they they look nice at the end and is that piece there it's like for to make it you know look nice and to make it easy for you to grab it and you know put it in um closure in your with your clasp so yeah i that's what we're going to be using and of course you know your tools of course your tools i use a pair of scissors any scissors you have and um I'm gonna I use one of these I use um, these type of nose pliers and I use a cutting uh, pliers and these silicone pliers so now with this I'm just gonna put this on here and right there so what I do is I uh, put it all the way in, right? All the way in. And I hold it there in one side. And I grab my glue gun and I put a drop of glue, just a tiny drop of glue in the inside, all the way in the back, just like that just for this to hold in peace for me while i'm um using my silicone plier and i'm pinching the ribbon down see once i have this side pinched i'm going to then pinch the rest of the ribbon see so i have it there now we're going to do the other side and it's going to be the same procedure just going to put the ribbon all the way in as best as you can okay try to make sure that it's even okay grab my glue gun and i'm going to put it dot of glue a tiny dot of glue inside there to make my ribbon to stay in place while I'm squeezing this with the silicone piece okay now I'm holding and I keep squeezing okay so now we have this like this completely done and this is the front part and this is let me see I want to make sure again I think this is back um, yeah this is the front okay so now we are going to put a jump ring so we're going to grab our jump ring and we're gonna open the jump ring and we're gonna put the jump ring through here all right and we are going to close the jump ring and I'm thinking I'm gonna get I don't know how to make the camera to get closer so you guys can see probably a little bit better so I'm gonna close my jump ring right there and with this I'm gonna squeeze to make sure it's even and it nothing's gonna oh sorry I shouldn't close it because I have to put the chain so my bad Mm. 
it's hard to do this through the camera guys so now we're gonna put the chain okay now the cha chain is there and we are going to close this okay we close it okay and either with this part or with the flat part here i just squeeze really hard to make sure it's really close and nothing's gonna come off okay so one is there i'm going to put another jump ring in this side and i have it here and i'm going to open this one Okay, it's open. And before I close it, close it, um, I'm gonna cut like this chain like in half. So, I think I'm gonna cut it like about here. And I'm gonna grab this and I'm gonna cut this here, okay? And then this piece of chain that I have here, I'm gonna put it in the other side where I have the jump ring open still. That's what I'm gonna put the other piece of the chain. See, you don't use two chains. With the one chain, with the one piece of chain, you're gonna uh, make two pieces you gotta cut it in half so right there and we are going to close it okay make sure that it's really good it's close really really good oh. Okay, wait a minute. It's like overlapping and I don't want that. Right there. I'm going to pinch it right there. Okay. Which it's going to be very, very close. Very nicely. Okay. So now we have. Let me um, may move you. Okay. Right there. Now we have. Um the two sides with um a little bit of chain on both sizes do you guys see okay so now in this side we're going to put another jump ring again another jump ring we're going to open a jump ring here okay and then this um piece here that i show you this tiny piece, we're gonna put it in the jump ring right here, and then we're gonna put it in the end of the chain. Oops. Oh my gosh. Okay, already. Okay. fall off <laughs> of course so there we go and now what we're gonna do it's close the jump ring okay I'm gonna pinch right there really hard to make sure it's close and nothing gonna come out so this piece is, is complete and now we're gonna grab another jump ring we're gonna put a lobster clasp in the jump ring at the other end and we're gonna put it in the chain 
here and we're going to close this jump ring there we go and i'm going to squeeze this very tightly okay nothing's going to come out oh my god look at how cute it's looking very very pretty and what i do to put the charm because i put a charm on these is these charms that i received also uh in previous package from um bb craft and what we're gonna do is easy we're gonna grab another jump ring and we're gonna put this charm in a jump ring so let me open this jump ring here there you go okay and then oops let me fall off okay so right there we have it in the jump ring and now what we are going to do is we are going to find like the middle of this ribbon and we're going to place it in the middle and the middle is like about here so i'm going to go through here and i'm just going to go like this and i'm going to close the uh, jump ring right there it looks very nice right there great wow look how pretty is that guys it looks fabulous and girly and that's how you put this cute bracelet together and yeah you can match it with you know your purple sandals your purple tennis shoes and your purple shirt your purple purse or you could just simply put it on with whatever you want you don't have to match it you know if you don't want to and it's super cute and it looks very cute you know with the hint of gold i think they look very very nice so this is a cute very very cute idea for you to um uh, have a new um way to wear um jewelry actually so i highly highly recommend check bb craft for all these jewelry pieces because they are very very inexpensive um very affordable and you know what for a little of money you receive so many things in one pack you know like i can believe the price of these um ribbons that i receive i receive all these ribbons and the price of these is just like not that much so i think it's great you know i will link all the products down below for you guys um as always and i hope that you guys like the tutorial i hope that you guys you know make some and like them and wear them and you know may you can make these for your um family your friends or for yourself so yeah hope that you guys like the video please a thumbs up is always appreciate leave me a comment down below if you have any questions also leave it uh, down below and thank you so much for watching and don't forget again to check bb craft for awesome products guys uh thank you so much for watching and i'm going to see you guys in the next crafty video bye bye now